for today but when you see the abomination of desolation standing where he ought not to be let the reader understand then let those who are in judea flee to the mountains mark 13:14 what did jesus mean when he spoke about an abomination of desolation was it about an impending intrusion into the jerusalem temple by a foreign invader probably even worse than its literary intent these were the words spoken by jesus he forewarned his believers of something heinous that was to take dominion in the minds and hearts of men let the reader understand was how he emphasized its criticality the desecration of the human body the temple of god the desecration of the law of nature esotericism taking hegemony above the divine law and the desecration of the family connivance and neutrality to sinfulness condonation of gay marriages were just some of these atrocities that the lord was pointing out to and when you see these where they ought not to be in your homes communities neighborhood the church etc we are asked to keep away flee to safe places you and i are guardians of humanity the dignity of the human person is what matters most and is to be protected living in times when relativism has obtained an upper hand and men live for pleasure and mere satisfaction of the senses you and i are called to cast light make the mark stand for the truth reprove sin and elucidate the path to eternity to live distanced from the world while in the world is what the lord asks of us today reflect on those abominations that are destructive to community to humanity those around you and those brought in by trends in society culture and community and plead for mercy and grace from the lord may this day be a day of prayer and penance for all sins of mankind that we may worthily receive the prince of peace in our hearts this christmas amen dr mini sherino